zero plus five seconds. Lift off normal. P1 Here tracking. we have a majestic lift off of LBM three M four rocket carrying India's prestigious Chandrayaan three spacecraft. P two tracking. Joining us right now, Dr. Sanjan, the director of your Rao Satellite Center, sir. A great day for Indian space journey, uh, especially the six payloads that are there. How important are they, sir? Because many are asking, uh, why have uh, the equipment called SHAPE, which will also look at uh, Earth from the moon's orbit and the surface uh, study of uh, moon? See, the uh, interest about uh, uh, the moon is to know about its material, what are the material available and what are their properties. That interest comes from two reasons. One is there is a, always a speculation. There are some highly valuable chemicals and minerals available on moon and uh, whether it is exploitable. So first you need to find out where it is, what is there. That is one reason. Second reason is uh, the entire uh, uh, space spacefaring world is uh, looking at making moon as a base for future uh, interplanetary exploration. So whether it is, is it possible to uh, to to manufacture some of the like propellants and uh, equipments on the surface of moon itself is one of the uh, ideas. So the interest in the finding out the chemical and material properties of lunar soil is whether these these can be converted into propellants and other material. These are this is a second instance. The whole world is looking at these problems from only these two points of view. Okay. Also, I believe seismic activity is being studied on lunar surface probably for the same reason. Uh, seismic as activity is, is suspected on the lunar surface, though there are no recorded or uh, measured data available about uh, uh, seismic activity on lunar surface. The seismic activity tells about the geology of the Earth. The seismic activity on Earth is due to the geology of the Earth. Yes. So, uh, if there is a seismic activity on the moon, that will also give a, Today, there is some understanding about what what the the core of the moon is like, how is the rock structure in the moon like, some understanding is there. If there is a moon quake, then it is going to give a completely different idea about the, uh, the structure of moon. That is why there is an interest in Finding out even there are very mild tremors in uh, moon surface. That is why this uh, moon quake. Sir, so Chandrayaan 1 lasted more than what it was designed for. In this one, uh, I, the initial idea is that it will last uh, 14 Earth days, that is one moon day. But is there a possibility that this will go beyond that, sir, when the sun actually comes back to the same area? It, it, is, a, it is a lottery. It, uh, okay. Because we have made certain design choices so that it gives a better chance for the instruments to survive. But uh, the temperature that it is going to experience during this lunar night is uh, less than minus 150 degrees centigrade. So it is highly unlikely everything will survive. But we are keeping our fingers crossed and we have made certain design choices which will allow this uh, equipment to survive. Uh, so we are hoping it may survive, but we cannot uh, say anything now. Okay, sir, my final question. One challenge in the next three to four weeks, sir. Uh, till August 23rd, that's when you're hoping that uh, the soft landing will happen. Uh, the challenge is not to make any mistakes. Okay. That is a challenge because we know what is to be done. Uh, we know how, uh, how it is to be done. We have done so much of simulations, so much of testing. Only you need to make sure that you don't make a mistake. Thanks a lot for speaking to us, sir, and congratulations. Thank you. Thank you.